Lord of mercy. Reach inside. But we are on a new foundation. You come and go. Reach inside us to the head
this is going to understand all that. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. And we pray about it. He said, you know, say, I was reading first John. I was reading said not to. I was reading Psalms. And it says, let not your heart be true. He believed in God, but he was so. We are in trouble, but he might find us out there are many lambs. If we were not so, then he would have told us about it. And then we might, okay, then, oh, I didn't see that guy. We come in church and maybe we preach what we don't illustrate as how we do it now. We don't take time out to tell somebody, when God says he's done, he's done. But if you trust God enough, sometimes you don't trust him in the community. So we overcome one dog. Then one thing I want to be a lot of mercy inside you. If we're trusting completely, let the dog come out right away. Right on the spot. But we are Christian. Let me be Christian in expectation. I want to understand me. Okay, maybe I want to see you. Maybe I want to fight. Yes, no. I don't want to fight. So the first thing you're going to go up. So when you go back, you're going to go, no. Pray. Pray. In all things, put me first. You are the man that I'm going to be keeping on. You want to get a man on this side, boy, for me. Yeah, 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 yeah. Ask him first, Lord, you know my situation. Uh, if it's not so, then Father, you know what I have it, then you don't give it. But you need me to have it. I ask the Lord that be clear with that and be go and achieve in your name. Let me say, Father, everybody you are in. Hey! Amen. You know me as sugar. Who not sugar as pressure? Who not pressure? I'm very tired of diabetes. Who not have diabetes? I saw my chest pain. Who not have chest pain? I'm me pain. Hey! What are that fasting ones? When you have a problem with that fasting need, you take it to the Lord and pray to Him. We need a good day. So we are counting with God. You're telling you what they need. You're telling your God they need. No, let me sit down before. Many people give me time now. But we don't want to give up anything. Yeah, I know. But they got fast in books. They marry them to go look for me us, man. They marry them to go look for me wife. After that, they remember fasting. Wrong way. They remember fasting in books. After the fast, you go and look for your husband. The fast in the end. So you're coming and you're going to sanctify. Well, be clear. I'm glad you're coming to. Because you're going to give your husband. You're taking it. Amen. I will get quiet. You're taking it. You're going to give your husband. Yes, sir. When we fast, be not as hypocrites. Outside continent, and of course, you know, say it. Why are you coming here fasting? Can you wake up? You say, the Lord, man, the Lord is most. Hey, you're going to find out, bro. Can you not eat? Check your boss. Why are you saying, Friday, man, this is more? Hey! Hallelujah. You're going to eat some man inside. You're going to put this out in your head. I went to the best and it would be a hard four and everything, a four and it would be four and. But now I don't want to give up something for anything. But me want to give up for that being blessed. Me. Don't be of sad countenance. For they disfigure their faces that they may appear unto men to fast. Where they said unto you, they have been reward. But thou, when thou fast, anoint thy hand and wash thy face, that thou appear not unto men to fast. What unto thy father with sit in secret. And thy father with sit in secret shall reward thee openly. Here we are now. This is our problem. Lay not up for yourself treasures upon the earth. We are true man too. Mm. Yeah. Jesus took you to my right, he said, right, and there is. Lay not up 
For your self treasures on earth. We are mutt and rust with corrupt. And we are thieves break through and steal. But lay up for yourself treasures in heaven. We are neither moth nor rust do it corrupt. And we are thieves do not break through nor steal. For where your treasure is, they will your heart be also. Send this son to Jesus. And Jesus said, Never will have a place where you can't come with me. You want to go to it? No, me. This is a bit better. Okay, of course, no one lives up. I began to be one too. I was going to ask Jesus to give me. Hey! I'm going to give you a little. You're going to give me a little. You know what I'm going to give you a little. Maybe. I just asked for it. You're going to give me a little. We're looking at better things. Because this too shall pass. This too shall be done away with it. Anywhere your treasure is, there your heart will be. Also, bless the name of Jesus. Final passage. I know you really want to go. I know I get that bad. Nobody don't want to put on Nobody don't want to put on No, next time. You need to be silent. Because you know what? Those who are going to lay it down, I mean, you best of all, I say, I don't know what you do with them. I just have no. You do it without all heart and that blessing. Yes. You know, some people come to church and they shine all the way.
first one there in Lent. Oh Lord, who for our sake did us fast 40 days and 40 nights? Give us grace to use such abstinence that our flesh being subdued to the spirit, we may ever obey thy godly motions in righteousness and true holiness to thy honor and glory. Who liveth and reigneth with the Father, the Holy Ghost, one God, world without end. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Bless the name of Jesus. We are who we are. Um, there is a scripture for every day. Two scriptures for every day Lent. Every day Lent carry two uplifting scriptures. We can go through what I do. What does the Lord do? We can go through them. Bless the Lord. Amen. And let's say go through them. I don't know if you just Read them, meditate on them. We take you our fight. You can't know. I have seen you can't go back now. We like I say, we But we must say, you can't go and tell yourself. Maybe come in our chakras and from the same one we love. Maybe call you and tell you which scripture. May I know your number? What would you want to tell everybody? If I bless you, whatever you want to do. What I'm saying, church? These scriptures are going to bring you to some places where you put yourself to work. Because the coming stages are going to look in your life and see how you live. You're going to want things and you're going to need things, but you can't get it without God. Because spiritual things are come from man. Temporal things man can give you, but that which you need, which is a substance for life, only God can give you. And when you realize that only God can give that bridge, you will be closer. Closer to Him. We are in a time now where war and violence and everything is rampant. Here he says rampant. Carry God bring God is rampant. But you cannot allow that to distract you from the word of God. You cannot allow it to distract you. Because we are where you have tears, where you have strength, where you have love, you find peace. <laughs> Why not? Why not? And why can't we realize this as a people? If you come to the world, your family, and that's the thing I want to bring to you God only give Jesus Christ that. Who will be that son that chance? Hey, Father, give me. How about you go there for them people? He not said it ever. He said it will be that son. That we may have life. And that's what we're working for, Richard. To live eternally after. He said those who are not dead will change in the twinkle of an eye. I would like to live again. I would love to live again. It's a desire for me to live again. Just imagine if you have some money, you're going to buy one Ferrari, you're going to buy one jet to fly you with. With God, you give all what you need, you don't need no Ferrari, you're just full of peace and love. All things are not one umbrella. But the thing of it, we will then not think of temporal but spiritual things. We bless the name of Jesus. Yes, Lord. Pastor, the word, the first one passes for me, and then uh, close in Jesus' name. Amen. Yes. 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 Bless the name of Jesus. Praise the Lord. 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 I read from the this uh, second Corinthians six from one to ten. 
We then as workers together with him beseech you that he receive not the grace of God in vain. For he had said, I have heard thee in a time accepted, and in the day of salvation have I secured thee. Behold, now in the accepted time, behold, now in the day of salvation, giving no offense in anything, that the ministry be not plain. But all things approving ourselves as the ministers of God, in much patience, in, in affliction, in necessity of distress, in strife, in imprisonment, in in tulip, in the labors, is watching, in fasting, but but preserved by the knowledge, by long suffering, by the kindness, by the Holy Ghost, by love. And forged by the word of truth, by the power of God, by the armor of righteousness, on the right hand and the left, by honor and dishonor, by evil report and good report. As deceivers and yet true, as unknown as you will know. As thine, and behold, we live and chastise and not kill. As sorrowful, yet always rejoicing, as poor, yet making many rich, as having nothing and yet possessing all things. Here in our portion of God, holy world. We say thanks be to God. Shall we bless the Lord? Shall we bless the Lord? I heard the man tell Pastor Ellis about the vision. Pastor Ellis had a vision for a fasting for the church. And uh, we were contemplating this fasting. We can talk. There's a fasting for the church, which is well in um, Lent. So we were planning to then look at it and um, because sometimes you get some vision and you need a time to come back and go and see it. You understand? And uh, when this gentleman come today, now and start to clarify, we know we need to call him and she call him. That's a wall. God is the Spirit. And they that worship him must worship him in spirit and truth. I can tell you, Church of God, and I know most of these things. I, you know, so I went to my tell my father, I come to say, you know, I reach one, you cut out the rage. Yeah, so cut out my rage. Cut out my rage. Because what I said to you all that do I'm gonna put things here. Good things. You know, cut down some. You know. And, uh, it's not like you're gonna have to be in the unit for a month or anything like that. It's then I can worry about it. Um, but there's a fasting, a very important fasting for the church. Coming for Sunday, because what I want to do is now Lent. So we're gonna have fasting coming Sunday. Only way. So it's not like we're going to be a We will not start with a full fasting. Because this 40 days, uh, all the different, different settings within the church, and uh, we will then uh, explain to you through the word of God. And um, but Sunday coming, we want to have fasting. We won't be here second Sunday because it's uh, you know, what we're going to close now. Then we're going to discuss that for five minutes that we can. Oh, bless the Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you for your word, mighty God. Thank you for this understanding and your knowledge to give to us. Let us stand.